Hey, welcome to check out the Rileys. Today is St. Patrick's Day here in the Philippines, so I need to find something green to put on, and also I need to find something to drink. So stay tuned. Let's see what I find. Well, I found something green. <laughs> yeah, I know. I look beautiful. <laughs> but I also found something to drink. Red Horse. Check it out. It's Red Horse, everybody. I have never drank a Red Horse in all my years of being in the Philippines. I've never... I've always had uh, light beer and uh, Sam Meg Light is usually what I drink. And... Uh, you know, that's about it. I don't drink that often anyways. But today I wanted to do a test try of uh, the Red Horse. So like I said, it's my first time. I don't know what to expect. Some people say it's great. Some people say it's trash. I have no idea. So I'm going to try it out right here, right now. Check it out. So this is, uh, again, Red Horse. Extra strong is what it says here on the, on the horseshoe. This is a thousand mLs, so I don't know what that is in ounces, but uh, I'm gonna say it's about the size of a good 40 ounce, anyways, right? So I don't know my measurements that well, so bear with me. <laughs> oh, so I smell it already. So I, I stuck this in the freezer for a little bit to get it cold. So it feels cold, at least the bottle is. Everybody says good cold is how you should drink this stuff. But I had a, a friend of mine who says, you know, welcome to the Philippines where the food is hot or the food is cold and the drinks are hot. <laughs> but I'm going to try to drink this while it's still cold. So, yeah. So we'll uh, test it out. No, I haven't already been drinking. <laughs> Even though the the wig might uh, lead you to that thought, but let's try it out together, everybody. Let's go, Red Horse from the Philippines. While well, I'm in the Philippines, and this is their San Mig Brewers Incorporated makes this stuff. So let's go. Hmm. Hmm. Well, first first thought with that little sip that I just took, it's not as bad as what I've heard some people say. So, so far, okay. Let's see if we like the taste, though. It reminds me of something. I just can't think of the, the name of the beer. If you've had Red Horse before, what kind of American beer or any kind of beer that that you uh, think it tastes like? My wife's in there on live stream. She's up with uh, Franceschi and uh, Terry's there and some other beautiful Filipinas is on the panel with her. And uh, I forgot what White Ford's name is now. Or <laughs> I tell you, tell her, tell you her name. But she's on. The, she was on the panel. I'm not sure if she's still there. Let's drink some more of this. It it doesn't taste as strong as like a um, like a Budweiser. I think it tastes a little more strong. I don't know. This is supposed to, supposed to be strong beer. I don't know what the content level is. It says extra strong. Surely somewhere on one of these labels it tells you the alcohol content. But I am not seeing it. Oh, here it is. 6.9%. 6.9% for Red Horse. Let's go. We're still drinking. Hey, have you seen Mercy disappear? I told you to show you some magic. I don't know what my wife's in there talking about. She's talking about disappearing. So, uh, yeah, this, this beer is not bad at all. It's not, it doesn't taste strong. I mean, I drink the light beer because, you know, I'm concerned for my figure. But usually I like the lighter beers, you know, as far as taste-wise. But this, 
this don't taste bad. So some of the stuff I heard about it is uh, was bad, but yeah, tastes tastes good to me. Of course, I'm drinking it out of a coffee cup or a mug or whatever. This is typically the kind of stuff I drink out of here in the Philippines. I don't know why. It's either this or some little bitty uh, cups that, that we always have around the house. But this is not bad beer. I think I'd like it better if I had like something I was eating on, right? Maybe something kind of salty. Maybe some pretzels. Maybe some uh, peanuts. Uh, maybe some nachos. So, yep, Notre Dame won this morning. I was watching them, or I was on King Lee's uh, new ch new channel name. I can't remember. It's K something sports. Sorry, I tried to do a shout out, but I can't remember your channel's name. Maybe I'll put it here. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for coming and having, it says leader right here. So, so that's how much it is. <laughs> I'm a little late to the party, guys. Like I said, it's like a 40 ounce. That's what it, that's what it seems like anyways. So I tell you what, everybody, I'll finish this up. Um, happy St. Patrick's Day to you and yours. I am part Irish, so, you know, I tried to uh, do a little bit of a celebration, you know. At least uh, break off a little bit of that Irish in me, right? And we see a uh, Irish theme music. I can't. Can't do it. Maybe if I finish this, I, I'll be able to, though. But anyways, Red Horse gets a thumbs up for me. It's it's pretty good. So, not bad at all. I will buy more of it. I, I kind of like it. It's a little bit, uh, little bit of a stronger taste than my uh, Semig Light that I drink, so... It's not bad for a change up. Till next time, everybody. Don't forget to comment. Tell me if you drink Red Horse or not. Like, share, subscribe, all that kind of good stuff. Till next time, check out the Rayleigh's.